Oh, Thermos Jar is here, and I have an interesting topic to bring out. So a buddy of mine has checked out Starfield yesterday after a break from it. And we streamed it. We went on the store page. Well, it's mod page. And and here you go. I spun it right away. He, he didn't. So the first thing that they sell, like it's made by Bethesda, the, 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 the guy with the gun and the cowboy hat. So it's practically a quest for 700. Uh, Bethesda coins, whatever it's called. And I was like, okay, so what does it add? The guy showed me it pretty much adds nothing. It's just a little thingy. It's it's nothing really game, big in the game. It's it's literally just another system they added in the game to be a quest. Then there's player homes. By the way, they in invited some of the big modders from Skyrim that used to do player homes, like famous one. And he's it doing things here. <laughs> for for creation credits, whatever they called, that's the coins. It's funny to see that. It's really funny to see that. It's like if it has these co contracting contractors to make their shit, because they're so incompetent. Oh my god. Yeah. Going back to the topic. So I went to the Steam, right? I went to Steam, and I wanted to see how much it would cost. Let's say if I don't have credits like if the, the Bethesda didn't give me the coins yeah pretty good isn't it so it's pretty much 10 10 euros for that mission to try out I know I know eh, what money don't have money well bro if you one of those people who says well you don't have money you poor then you are fucking retarded because for 999 you can get a game on Steam or you can get many games that are cheap and affordable and have way more playability than Starfield. Right now we could go to store and we can find something below ten dollars or ten euros. And that will last you longer than Bethesda experience. And don't fucking start that shit. Oh it's it's a big game anyway, made by AAA. So fucking what? It's it's wide as an ocean, shallow as a puddle. I'm prepared for this conversation. I know what Starfield. I've saw it. And it takes just a minute to open reviews to see what people actually think about game. Man, kudos to Steam for that shit. Because this is probably beautiful. You can just see what people actually think about the game. I don't know why you guys are giving a good thumbs up, but we have received a distress call I think these are the most honestly honest reviews you can get from a game like this but anyway my point was to bring out this trash store of theirs and a little bit throw shit at Bethesda for being scummy with more than it used to be and I hope some of you will change minds on this video game company and try to find something else that you can play and not invest in a game that is sucking money dry from us so have a nice day, enjoy the weekend or whatever day, day you're going to watch this. This is Thermos Jar, over and out.